that that match right there is the one that got us to the WWE because we got called a week later. But uh, when we first got in there, nobody wanted to wrestle the Steiners. They were, you know, supposedly hurting people and, you know, throwing them on, you know, every which way but loose. And because let's face it, Ricky and Scotty are the real deal. They both are national champions from, uh, you know, Michigan. They went uh, collegiate wrestling. They played football and they, you know, wrestled. And, you know, they knew what the heck they were doing when they were in there. So when we got in there, <laughs> they said, hey, we're going to put you against the Steiners. And me and I said, great, because you got two barroom fighting, fighters, brawlers, you know, going against guys that know what they're doing collegially, wrestling-wise, and can flip you on your head any second, any time. But, you know, we like the physicality. And you know what? We never had a problem. We had the greatest matches. At that Halloween Havoc match, they said to us, you know, you're going 25 minutes. And, you know, me and said, 25 minutes with the Steiners, this is going to be good, you know. And it turned out to be one of the greatest matches. Uh, we used to hear that a lot. And uh, we were really proud of that match. And we both gave it all we had. And we really became, we bonded. After that match, we really bonded. We already had matches before. And we were the first ones ever to lay them out. I don't know if you know that, but we had like a, you know, contract signing in the ring for the belts, and we smashed them, smashed them with their belts, you know, smashed them through the table, and that never happened before back in the day. You know, not very seldom, but, you know, it happens a lot now. And nobody let the Steiners lane, and we did. So, I mean, it, it built even more, you know, uh, that people wanted to really see us get our butts kicked because at the time the nasty boys were truly the nasty boys and one of the most hated tag teams and uh it, it all worked out great man it, it you know i got the frankensteiner it looked like it took off my head and you know uh thank god i you know got out of that move without any injuries but uh but i just watched that match the other day and uh, i still think it's one of the best matches out there and, and just not because i'm in it but it was a real brutal match, and we both gave it all we had. But it was, you know, you could tell. And just like you said, you, you could tell we were really getting each other. There was, there was no pulled punches in that one. That was a total uh, straight-up uh, war, if, you want, if you, you want to know the truth. Oh, yeah, I absolutely love